Hi everybody, this is Catherine, your favorite French Canadian. Today I'm going to talk about the new update from Windows, the 2004 version, uh, almost one year after the 1909. A couple of interesting stuff for you guys who want to optimize your uh, computer. Uh, first of all, I will show you how to do it. After that, we will talk about it and I will show you a couple of benchmark that I did to show you what kind of improvement that you can get with this update. So first of all, make sure that you check your for update. You will have two options. First option, you will see that uh, you will have the Windows update download and install. So you're good, you can download it. The thing is, Microsoft didn't push the, uh, the new version for everyone. It's like each week they're pushing more and more. So if you want to force it, I will put the link in my video description. You have an official link on Microsoft.com. Just click update now. It will uh, download a small like software, 10 meg and you can update it by yourself. So really important to do that. Second thing that you really need to do is make sure that you update your NVIDIA uh, driver because if you want to have the uh, hardware accelerated GPU scheduling, the new feature from uh, this uh, new update, you really need to uh, update your NVIDIA driver. I don't think AMD released the new uh, version now, so pr probably they will release a new driver like in a couple of weeks uh, to make sure that you, you can get the full... Uh, the full package the, on the hardware acceleration GPU scheduling. Second thing that you need to do is go to GPU, so graphic setting over there. By default, the new uh, feature here, the hardware acceleration uh, GPU scheduling, will be at off. So really important to check this and make sure that it's, it's at on. So this is pretty much like um, it will improve the way that uh, the uh, Windows handle video memory. Uh, so Technically, you should get more FPS and you can also it will reduce the latency when you're playing the game. We know already that uh, AMD and NVIDIA always uh, they just pushed like an update six months ago uh, to reduce latency. So the latency, low latency mode on NVIDIA and AMD. But now you can do it with the hardware accelerated GPU scheduling. Second thing that's it's really important, uh, they fixed a bug. If you have two different monitor uh, with two different uh, Ertz. So for example, uh, your main monitor is 144 and your second is 60. Uh, they uh, fixed the bug. So the bug was if something moves in your 60 Ertz screen, your 144 Ertz monitor just go down to 60 and you will see like stuttering and stuff like that. I saw that because when I was streaming uh, my main monitor, sometimes I was like getting stuttering it, and it was because my chat was moving in my 60 Ertz monitor. So now they fixed it. I'm really happy about it. So you don't have to buy two uh, 144 Hertz monitor. Um, yeah, that's about it. The last thing is Ryzen processor. I don't know if you guys remember last year, uh, AMD talked about like they're working with Microsoft to uh, make sure that uh, they, 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 they work on the uh, scheduling on Windows because the problem is what was they were taking like your... Uh, lowest slash baddest core on your Ryzen CPU and push it to the game. So for example, if you have a core that can do 4.3 and you have another one can only do 4.1, sometimes like application or, or games were taking like the uh, uh, weakest one. So uh, they kind of fixed it because uh, I did a couple of benchmark and my CPU now is uh, normally I'm getting 6% of increase with my performance on my 3900X. So I will show you my result. Uh, I'm impressed, honestly, with the, this uh, new um, with this new uh, patch from uh, Windows. So this is my benchmark. Um, this is all the percentage that you're seeing right now. It's versus the oldest version, the 1909. Uh, the first one is with AGS on, so AGS is hardware accelerated GPU scheduling, and the the other one is AGS at off. First of all, on Cinebench, uh, I'm getting 6% of an increase in my uh, in my score. So it's 6% for both because Cinebench, by the way, it's R20. And um, it's just a test for your CPU. So you don't have GPU right now uh, on this test. So that's why I'm getting the same result. On Time Spy, <laughs> sorry, it's the same. Um, it's a mix between your CPU and GPU. I'm getting 3% of increase in my score and 2% with AGS off. So 1% increase on my GPU, technically. Uh, I know the benchmark. I'm getting 2% over there, 1% at AGS off. Gears 5, 3% of increase, 1% at AGS off. And finally, Forza Horizon 4, 3% AGS on and 
uh, one person hacks off. So on my 2070, I'm getting like 2% of increase in my FPS. I did a couple of tests on my laptop. It's an i7 um, 8000 series with a GTX 1050. I didn't see any improvement on my Intel CPU, but on the GPU, I was surprised. I'm getting like 4 to 5% of increase. I don't know if it's because the, the, the GPU is more limited with the video memory and because of the new optimization, uh, it's making more FPS, but uh, it's a nice boost over there. Um, one thing that I want, uh, I want to say, when you're putting your AGS at on, I'm getting like 4 degrees increase on my GPU. So I don't know why. I did a couple of tests, different game. It's always 4 to 5 degrees of increase. So if you pretty much have the same thing, just comment in the YouTube section if you have this issue. Uh, I'm kind of surprised that just a small feature in your <laughs> Windows can increase your, um, your degree like that. Uh, so this is the first thing that I saw and for latency it really depends sometimes I didn't see anything like for an example on time spy I don't see a reduced latency probably because my GPU usage was at 100% but in some games I'm getting like an increase by a re the, the latency is reduced by like 4 to 6 percent so I saw an increase over there so it's pretty decent honestly right now I did a couple of tests um, I'm still gonna test it on like some more like beta game like Tarkov and maybe a, also Call of Duty Warzone. But honestly, just put your Ags at on. I, ne I didn't see any like scenario that Ags uh, was less good than uh, Ags at off. So uh, just use it, honestly. I'm really impressed. Make sure that you update your GPU and make sure that you activate it on Windows and you will be surprised. So that's about it, guys. Just uh, comment in the YouTube uh, video section. Post me like what kind of result that you had, like if you're running a laptop, desktop, what kind of GPU, CPU, did you have an increase, do you have an issue with uh, uh, temperature, uh, whatever that you want to share, uh, we will share all our information together. Thank you very much guys and peace.